Hi, this is Michelle Green, and in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add an autoresponder opt in form to your web page or your squeeze page slash capture page. Using Get Response, you would go to Subscribers, Build Subscriber List, and then you would select Capture Subscribers. Here you have some options you can insert an opt-in form to a web page or your capture page you can create a pop-up window with an opt-in form or if you've already created pop-up windows um, you can manage your existing pop-ups we're going to go with HTML form since we're going to be inserting this into a squeeze page and then uh, under option 2 what would you like to capture subscribers for you would choose the list that you want to capture subscribers for. So I'm going to go with 6 chapter and then click start capturing. And here you have some other options. Um, here if you want to create a custom confirmation page for after your subscribers enter their name and email address into your form you would put the URL to that confirmation page here. That confirmation page would usually say something like uh, check your email, validate the link within the email, that type of thing. Um, for the error page, if, if they get an error message after entering their name and email, you could do a custom page for that. Uh, if you leave these blank, get responses, default page will just come up. Um, another option that you might want to consider is the tracking code right here this will allow you to track uh, where your subscribers are coming from so if you have multiple uh, opt-in forms for this particular list you might want to track track them so that you know where all of your subscribers are coming from and then you can also check out some of these other options that they have once you've picked your options just click next step and here is the HTML code for your opt-in form click select all, right click, copy, and then go to the software where you're uh, editing your web page. I'm using InView and you can get InView at www.nvu.com. You can pick that up for free. Place your cursor where you want your opt-in form to go. Go up to the insert menu, select HTML, and paste that autoresponder code into there and select insert and then your opt-in form is now on your page these lines here um, these are just how it's looking in edit mode but if you click on preview this is how it's going to actually look on the web page then you just save your work and you're all set